So berries, um, they're cool, right? We always think like, oh man, I'm gonna eat healthy. Let me get some berries, right? How many berries can you eat though? Not a lot, right? You snack on them on your way home. You get home, you open and get a couple. Then what happens? You leave them there, stay in your damn fridge, right? Then you're like, man, I, didn't, I never ate them. This technique I'm gonna show you, you can easily do with berries that are going bad. Not they're going bad, but they're on their way out already. Um, so if you, go, if you go to any grocery store and you see blueberries, blackberries, whatever, and they're like a, like a buck or two bucks, um, grab them and I'm gonna show you what you can do. So this is super easy. You're gonna get some sugar like this. You can use whatever kind of sugar. I like using white sugar because we're not fancy like that. And um, I get usually about three spoons of sugar and then whatever you like to drink. Um, I'm using vodka though. So then what we're doing is we're gonna introduce this vodka together. So it's vodka and sugar now, right? So what we're trying to do is balance out the sweetness with the, with the strong you know, flavor of vodka. And then all we're gonna do is stir it. Stirring in. Okay, and I promise that once it's done, it's gonna look good. Like right now, it looks like wet glue. Is there a fruit or a berry that you prefer? Like I like everything and anything, really. What about bananas? I did not, you said there would be no banana jokes on this. You could leave them whole, but if you cut them, it's, it works a little bit faster. So then we're gonna quarter them. So you slice off the back part, right? So it's flat, it does this thing, and then we just go down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So then it's quartered. Right, so it's like that, it's all fancy. You can see the inside. So then, you don't have to do it like that, man. You could do them like this, or you could do rings if you want to. Right? Like that. Slight, thick slices. Just depends on what, you, what you're feeling. Like I said, you can leave them whole too, man. You can leave them like that. Or you can even smash them so you get it. You push it down like this. See, it looks really weird, but. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna mix it all together like this, the way I'm doing. Right? And then like, if you have mint, I don't have mint in my house, but if you're fancy, you wanna you want go to the grocery store, spend five bucks on mint, by all means, get it. You can put it in here, you can put lemon zest in here, you know, but I'm just trying to find whatever I have in the fridge to make something easy. I don't wanna leave the store, or the house, I don't wanna put shoes on, you know, I have to find my, my good shorts, I don't wanna do any of that. And what happens is that, you know, as long as they sit, you know, they start to lose all of the juice, you know, and it, be, and it starts to transform into this beautiful, like, not jelly, but you know, it's just like beautiful, like liquid that you can pour over basically anything. Your ice cream, you know, your oatmeal in the morning, you know, your waffles, your pancakes, you know, even if you want to just eat it just like that while you're watching TV, or you know, or if you make lemonade, you can throw in your lemonade, you know, and the cool thing is that, you know, so not only are you getting the most for your money, you know, you're repurposing something in, and you can have a jar full of it in your fridge. You know, and, and as long as that, you know, it's, you, you know, you use it and you, 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 like you take care of it, it'll last you a while. 